Bora TV. The world is thinking. SOM um, designed this, which is now the tallest building in the world, may even be exceeded by another building soon in Dubai, where the physical form uh, was a response to too much money or credit and too little thinking. As I've shown uh, elsewhere, um, every time the tallest building is announced, the world moves into recession. And one can trace this easily back from 1890 through to the Woolworths building, through to the Chrysler building, uh, and of course uh, these very tall buildings are in fact uh, only symbols. They are not economically uh, at all useful. Uh, the, the Empire State Building has made no money at all for its owners. And the builders of this building, Narkil, an Australian working for, for them, told me that this would make absolutely no money or be any use. It was simply a symbol that would sell the other buildings in this part of Dubai. So we move now away into, back into the question of style, into the architecture of pure form. So we get towers like this and then Zahi Haddad like this that are developing an architecture which is not at all contingent, simply the architecture of pure form. Um, so towers have moved beyond Mies, beyond the transcendence of Mies, to become simply consumer objects, very large consumer objects. They have the same life as automobiles, refrigerators or washing machines. Philip Fisher has distinguished four stages of object life. One, the materials or things that they're made of. Two, parts in which shape is given to materials to create repeating identical parts or elements. Three, assembly in which working objects are made out of a variety of parts drawn from different elements or stocks. And four, very importantly for us today, obsolescence, debris or junk, in which we face a mixed set of former objects. We see in the towers that we're building today um, very early obsolescence, use that uh, floor plates change, technology changes, um, unlike the great palaces of Venice which are used over and over again, we find after 25 years most of these sorts of towers are unusable. So we get here a range of these towers in Dubai. I think um, rather coquettish line-up like street prostitutes all trying to draw attention to themselves. Our modern object towers have this exact object life like automobiles, writ large, shiny, fashionable skin, routine and repeatable planning and junk in 25 years. 70% of our landfill is building debris. Bow form, if I could go back to Herring and Mies, should not be a mere modern object. The office towers are a clear example of how the principles of the revolutionary modern movement have been overcome by the architecture of pure form. 